Hello, my name is Bill and welcome to Mind Your Crypto. Today we have Chainlink Link Daily Update. We are going to explain why Chainlink is going to crash over minus 14% and in the next weeks over minus 40%. Before we continue, do not forget to join our monthly subscription Patreon slash Mind Your Crypto. You always know that here we tell the truth, no matter if it is a pump or a dump. We are going to say right now and we are going to see right now that Chainlink is going to revisit the 5.50. Okay, so I'm going to leave the first target right here. This is the first target, 5.51, around there. So what Chainlink is going to do over the next few days, it is going to have a crash of around minus 13%. Okay, so please be careful because right here Chainlink might not look so great and we might be going into a very huge stamp. You can see and you have to see that into the four hour frame, we are forming a very, very huge bearish pattern. This is a bearish pattern right here. And yeah, the lower highs and the higher lows after a downtrend indicate that we are going to go further down and crash. You can see it better in the daily frame as well. Lower highs, higher lows for the link. Chaining, okay, and this will indicate a huge crash for Chainlink coin. We are going to revisit the 5.51 for sure. Right now, for those that hold this altcoin and for those that think that it is going to hugely pump, it won't be happening. Okay, so what is going to happen though? In case you have bought right here and you want to invest, I want you to rebuy some right here there and of course the rest as you all know i am thinking that uh, the the chaining actually will be going towards the 3.44 okay so we are going to revisit the 5.52 and then we are going back down to 3.44 from where we are right now this is a minus 45 percent correction not to mention that it might go even lower but i will have this as a support level for the time being okay so 3.44 may be lower around this whole area right here between the 3.43 and the 3 USDT. I want you to buy one more time. Okay, so what you're going to do, it is simply you're going to reaccumulate at these points right here and then Chainlink will be off for something great. But until then, Chainlink is going to collapse. It is going to go down. It is going to go and break down from this bearish pattern. It is going to move down from it and it is going to move even further lower. Now, in the lower time frames, you might be seeing something like a bounce between these lines. Okay, so it could be the case that we do not break down right now. We go and jump to the three six point thirty one for sure. Okay, six point thirty one is going to be the first one. Then we are might be off for like um let's say that we go back up to 6.52 but we won't be having anything huge until we see the correction going on now it could be the case that we have a fake out to the upside and then we correct so be careful for that the result will be the same we are going to cross down and why i'm making this video because there are many many people saying that Chainlink has met the bottom it is not the case right now you're going to see that i am going to be right on that you're going to see that eventually Chainlink will be revisiting the 5.51 save this video for later because you will see that this will be the case for Chainlink because it is the price and technical analysis that matters right now. The price analysis is not good. Technical analysis as well is not that great. You can see that we are having uh, something that I do not like for Chainlink, which is lower highs, higher lows after a downtrend. It doesn't move. And of course, even in the lower time frames, we form bearish pennants, which, are, which can be the case that we go down. And of course, some people will say that, Bill, this might be a neutral triangle, right? I do not think that this is the case right now for Chainlink, seeing the technical analysis as well, seeing that we get detected from the 200-day moving average, and I do not think that Chainlink is off for something great right now. Um, Bitcoin is not helping as well. Okay, you can see that right here for BTC, we are going sideways for so many time right now, for like 
um, after so long, we are just going sideways and sideways. Okay, it doesn't help with the altcoins and especially chaining that it is not looking so great chaining against Bitcoin chart. I mean, and I think that a crash is coming pretty soon enough. Correction first to the 6.51 and then it won't be able to hold. We are going to fall down from it. Do not forget to join our monthly subscription, Patreon slash Crypto. Thank you for watching. Have a fantastic day and see you soon. Bye.